Okay, my YouTube family and friends, so today has been just a tough, tough day for me. It's such a tough day. As an educator for so many years, over 28 years now, you work with so many children, so, so many. Sometimes you forget the names, sometimes you forget the faces, but sometimes when tragedy hits, the names do come back quickly. <sighs> Hope that whoever you are, that you're in a good place today, that um, you're feeling blessed because you are blessed if you're here. Last night I was on Zoom supporting my aunt doing a presentation with Sam Sharp Teachers College. Um, they're having a program now where there are um, diagnostic things for trauma, for um, autism. My aunt does speech therapy in Jamaica. She has a school, it's a specialized school for kids who need the extra support. But after the Zoom, which was very successful, there was over 200 and something people um, tuned in last night on that. I was so very tired. But after that, then on the news, I realized that a 12 year old student was sitting in a car, was shot last night, and didn't know, in my head, I, I, I kept wondering, is it one of our students, is it one of our students? But regardless of it, if it was or not, it did strike a chord and I felt a little, my God, I just was saying, my God, my God, 12 years old, not even a teenager yet. Please, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do so, my people. Support my journey. Support, please, please support. If you don't want to support me as a person, support me as a teacher, as an educator. Support me as a grandmother. Support me as a parent. Support me somehow. And then this morning as I got up and I give God thanks to be here again. And I read, I saw that my phone, somebody was just texting, texting, realized that this was actually one of my students from my other school. And it strikes a chord. I mean, I have been trying hard to be strong, but I'm human. And so we have to understand that when these things happen, it doesn't matter who the student was, or how the student was, how smart the student was, or how disruptive the student was. It was a human being. It was a human being. She was sitting in a car. She wasn't involved in anything. She was sitting in a car. And people who had their beef or their situation was driving by and shooting at other people. And she sitting in the car was shot in the head. Oh, tough. So tough. It's not easy. If it can be good, be careful. But walk good, do good. Do good, my people. It's a good thing. 